Hey y'all, what's up? Today is super special because I'm here with Chase and we're talking all about home buying. So being in my later 20s, I'm starting to think about those big life achievements like home buying. And a lot of the way that I feel about home buying comes from the way I grew up. So as a kid, I was a military brat. I moved around almost every three years until I was a teenager. And that was mainly overseas. So I didn't even move to America until I was 13. And that's when my parents bought their first home was when I was a teenager. And so in my mind, I kind of grew up unconsciously thinking that I had to wait until I had teenagers or wait until I completely settled somewhere for the rest of my life to buy a home. I kind of want a home base. I, I think about all the traveling that I do and I love to travel, but having that home base is something that is becoming more and more appealing to me. I didn't know much about home buying. I mean, my parents had homes, but I never really talked to them about what that process was like for them. And also understanding that I have a different um, life experience than my parents. So my parents are very, you know, military, and that's very this, this, this. Me, my life is like all over. So for me to think about commitment in that way was just very, it's a lot overwhelming. But as I started just educating myself and talking to my friends, as we all are kind of progressing in life, more and more of us are wanting that home base and wanting that feeling of being secure somewhere. So there's always gonna be fear of the unknown, but the more you learn about the process, the more the fear will just go away. So for me, what that looks like is definitely sitting down with an expert, figuring out my financial profile, making sure that I'm starting to save money, how much I should save over a, a specific period of time because a difference between you know $500 a month or $100 a month is going to make a big difference in how long I wait to buy a home or how quickly I buy a home. And also preparing my credit, making sure that everything is great, that I'm not jumping into a home and not being financially stable. I think that is so key. So if you're like me and you're kind of venturing into that position of I'm ready to buy a home, these are a few tips that I've been using to guide my home buying journey. So number one is definitely linking up with an expert, somebody that understands you, understands your lifestyle, and can understand how to get you to where your goals are. Two is understanding the landscape, making sure that you know, you know more about what you're getting yourself into and that the more you know, the less fearful the process will be. And three is to work on your own timeline. Don't feel rushed. Don't feel like you have to be on anyone else's schedule. This is your process. So that's all I've got for you guys today. Thanks so much for watching. And until next time, make sure you guys go to chase.com for more home buying info. And I will see you in my next video. Bye.